Well, new at 10, a tight squeeze on slick streets is spelling trouble for some school buses in Minneapolis. Families told us that their kids' bus had gotten stuck nearly 10 times in the past few weeks. As our Kirsten Mitchell found out, parents are driving for change in their neighborhood while they hope the city finds a fix. In Minneapolis's Tangletown neighborhood, it's smooth sailing in the air. Yep, airplanes. <laughs> but a bumpy ride on the ground. It's kind of a fingers crossed kind of situation with the cars on the streets. Oh, it does say here comes the bus. Molly Loitz is waiting for her kids. There she is. To come home from school. She's gonna make it. But oh. the bus isn't always on time. In her ruts. Getting stuck on the narrow, ice rutted roads. Hi. It's been almost 10 times, probably overall, where it you know, there's some delay while we have to figure out how to get um, one of the parked cars to move. One time it really was stuck and they had to get the kids off the bus and get them to school a different way. I think the longest was maybe 20 minutes. Molly and her neighbors reached out to the city asking for one-sided parking. It's been a couple weeks of steady calling and trying to figure out how to sort of be a squeaky wheel. On Monday, signs went up. A block over, neighbors took it into their own hands, organizing one-sided parking amongst themselves. I, I get how it's an equity issue and a difficult one-size-fits-all answer, but everybody deserves safe streets to drive on and walk on and live on. It's important that people can get through. The city says it's continuing to address challenging areas, but the ice is hard on equipment and it's a slow process. We just wanted to support the bus drivers for the most part. You know, they work hard to get our kids to and from school safely, and it's they just had a really hard time. In Minneapolis, oh God. Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO 4 News. We reached out to Minneapolis Public Schools about this. They said that they are working with the city to address these issues.